Welcome guys to another hiking vlog. We're doing the Chimney Top Trail. Uh, as you can see, 0.25 miles is closed because of the fires a few years ago, unfortunately. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and take a, a look at this place. It looks like we're gonna cross the river. I believe this is the same river that eventually runs through Gatlinburg and Pigeon Forge. So, 1.75 Miles should not take too long. Elevation gain of about 2,000 feet. So uh, I'm hoping to have this done in an hour and a half at the most. So, or an hour and 45 at the most. So hopefully we can get that done and I don't underestimate how long this one takes because uh, the last one took a little bit longer than expected. So, uh, hopefully you saw that one where we went to uh, Bushy Mountain and um, the Grotto Falls. It's a really cool trail. And uh, I really enjoyed it. So, second hike here in the Smoky Mountains. Only second and final of this trip, unfortunately. Uh, but, you know, subscribe if you want to see more hiking vlogs because I love making them. I love this root system of this tree. Holy, wow. Like I've seen a lot of cool root systems, but that is impressive. That's practically straight up. That tree was like, I'm gonna find my place here if it kills me. Dang, it really shows you what the root system looks like in comparison because, I mean, seriously, like usually this would all be underground. Very neat, let's go. We're loving all these bridge crossings. Very nice. Aye. I'll take a steep ramp over steps any day. Oh. Yeah, I have, having to lift your foot up way higher, to me, is way more exhausting. But this is definitely a little too steep for a ramp. So that's where we're going. And you definitely can see all that fire damage all the way at the top already. So, all right, another bridge. Almost halfway there actually, but apparently we've only done a quarter of the height gain. So we've only done like a top throw dragster. So for those who are not into roller coasters, that would be 420 feet. Sure felt like more than that, I'll tell you what. All right, not gonna be much video on this one because it's relatively short, it's steep. This is horizontal so you can have an idea of what steep is on this, it's steep. And I'm gonna be having puffing the whole time. All right, see so you probably at the top or near it or when I decide to give up. Okay, it's like five seconds later, but if I had known the Appalachian Trail was only 2.4 miles away, I would have definitely had cut that first trail short and uh, hiked to the top of the chimney tops then gone to Appalachian Trail for a little bit. Said I was in Appalachian Trail in Tennessee, although it might be approaching Georgia or North. No, no, it's all Tennessee. Regardless, dang, I'm kind of obsessed with the Appalachian Trail. So, and I love the fact that I am like, 10, 11 hours away from home. And the Appalachian Trail from me is only about an hour away. I mean, I know it's a long trail, but my mind, I don't know, that's, that's cool. The last trail was marked as hard. It wasn't hard, it was medium. Maybe hard medium, but this is, it's still not really hard, but it's, it's at the lower end of the hard, that's for sure. Apparently, where we need to go, according to my GPS, is right in front of us on top of that hill. I, I don't know how, but we're going straight up, I think.
looks like we have a little bit further to go. There is chimney top. It's pretty. But definitely pretty. So uh, we started all the way down there in that valley. And by the way, I did it in about 54 minutes, which I won't lie, I'm impressed with myself. So, yeah, I see some people over there. But, uh, honestly, I'm exhausted, and I think the view from over here is probably going to be better than close-up anyways. So let's get a close-up on it, and we'll go down and uh, wrap up it with the sats. Counted. It's always good to be counted. <laughs> All right, probably got about five more minutes if that, which means I'll actually come in under the expected time. But I think that actually included. Go. Oh, that was fun. That's the only time I've fallen, at least on this trail. Maybe it's because I'm trying to talk and vlog at the same time while I'm exhausted. All right, well, it's pretty. Uh, anyways, what I was saying, uh, you know, about 3.6 miles is the distance. We already knew that. And elevation gain about 1,700. I'll put the final stats on the uh, screen now. But I think that's gonna do it. Had a fantastic day here in the Smokies doing these two trails. Uh, I wish I had time for more, but uh, I have a Dollywood pass, so I kinda wanna go tomorrow. But if it's busy, I'll definitely cut out early and do more trails. So uh, no, no video for Dollywood because uh, I did one like a week ago. So go check that out if you're interested in that. But uh, if I do, uh, do another hike uh, you know subscribe so you'll get notified and hit that bell notification anyways this is Alex for the coaster slash hiking spot like comment and subscribe and we'll see you so somehow I didn't realize when we walked in that we were going over two different rivers that join together right here the one that came up from the mountain and then I think the one well, ultimately, this goes down to Gatlinburg. So that's very cool. Yeah, uh, I think my mind was just on go, 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 go. <laughs> and I didn't realize it. Oh, and I love how the support there for that bridge is uh, very nicely and tastefully blended into the rocks right there. Uh, yeah, I haven't been looking forward to these steps right here the entire way down these are the death of me goodbye